All right, Shalom, stop, just listen. I'm going to give our praises to Yahweh yeah, by Shimmy, I was shy by Shimmy Kakodash. Double ones to our apostle and elders and great Muslims that taught us his truth. Peace and blessings to the seer, acting as person in truth, not to sincerity around the four corners of earth. Then diligent leads you, I say, Shalom. Shalom. You know, we're the brothers from the great Millstone Miami Church. That was every house, Shalom. We come back to the spirit, probably Yahweh by Shimmy, i making a lesson to the spirit. You know, low what you edify. You know, in this lesson, we're going we're gonna to speak about how <clears throat> this is not how we. How we are supposed to live, you know, because the scriptures speak, speak about how we're under the curses, you know, and Jake got to deal with Esau and Bill and, and what so, you know, and we know that we got something better than that that's coming, man. You know, we got a kingdom, you know, spiritual power and laws in our younger parts, man. You know, so low one we edify it. And I got you set. Just start with that Brook 3 and 8. This is Brook chapter 3 and verse 8. Behold, we are yet in our captivity, where thou hast scattered us, and reproach for a reproach and a curse, and to be subject to payments according to all iniquities of our fathers, which departed from the Lord our power. Right, man. You know, right, right now we in captivity, man. Under who? Esau, Edom. You know, and what? Jacob something to payments. And they got all type of bills. You know. Got car note, you know, that light bill, water bill, phone bill, electrical bill, you know, all these, all these, all, all these charges and things, you know, because guess why we under captivity, man, you know. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Right, <clears throat> you speaking about the curses. Okay, was it the same in that chapter? You shall go to your enemy for the one of all things. Okay, everything that we need to, to the clothes, to the food, to, to how we live, but okay, we gotta go to Esau, man. You know, whatever we, we need to sustain ourselves, we, we got to go to Esau for it. Okay, yes, we pray to the Lord. Okay, we pray to the Lord for these things, you know, for our daily bread. But the position that we're in, okay, it, it, it has to, we have to go to Esau. Esau has been Esau's uh, store, okay? You know, that's not, that's not how it's supposed to be, man, okay? Okay, because again, the, the Christians put on us because of our disobedience and us turning from Lord and serve other gods, okay? And that's how we live in the way we live. Okay, but you're saying, you know, better, better is coming. Okay, and that's the, that's the comfort, and that's the hope. You're talking about uh, us being subject unto payments. Okay. That's the spirit, because I was going to read out the group during A, was the brother already uh, just read. All right, that, that goes into, you know, us, you know, because we, we got, we got pay, you know, we got house bills, we got mortgage, we got car notes. You know things of that sort. You know, but that's part of the curses. Also, you know where where to tell. All right, because mm -hmm. right now we're in. We got you got a wicked ruling over us. Also, too, you know what the brother said. We got to go to the east off for the one of things. You know, for food. You know, for shelter and things of that sort. Even when to even when it comes to the food, we not even get a best of foods too. All right, it says you try to eat the foul bread amongst the Gentiles. Let me paraphrase. Let me get a grab it real quick. Let me see your phone. Hmm? All right, and basically, going back to right Is he good for? Yeah, he's saying. <clears throat> Are you saying, you know, we eat the foul bread, our food is poison? Okay, it doesn't really sustain us. Mm -hmm. That's why you may drink water, and you just been drinking water, and you're thirsty right after. You know, you're not getting the complete nutrients from the, from the food and from the water. You know, nothing but it said to we are in captivity, you know. You ain't supposed to be in the, in, in the mindset where this is your home, man. You, know? 13, yeah. you ain't supposed to be in the mindset where you're trying to settle down in Esau cap in the Esau's world, man. Oh, yeah. You know, because we have we are under bondage, man. You know, we are serving the time sentence. You know, till the hour shall come back. All right. This is Ezekiel chapter four, verse thirteen. It says, "The Lord said, even just shall children Israel eat eat there to fill the the fall." The foul bread among the Gentiles, whether I will drive, drive them. All right, you got all these type of defiled foods, the GMOs. You know they got these things called Beyond Meat, I believe. Mm -hmm. Beyond Meat, they make it um synthetic meat. All right, that's defiled, man. Mm -hmm. All right, the Lord made it where even to from the beginning we was had we had the herbs, we had these certain you know meats that was able to eat. But now as is the time that we live in, because ultimately because of who's ruling, all right, we eat. These wicked things, man. We eat these things that are unclean, unclean to us. You know, they, they might put they might put a little, you know, some in the food sometimes. 
our hidden ingredients, our all these things are not good, man. Our we try to you know also too we try to um you know eat was we try to you know adhere to you know laws of um uh, the dietary laws of bitch like bitch. But knowing Esau, he might even implement some 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 unlawful and call it something else. All right, that's that's the times we live in it. All right, it's basically going back to this life is not it. Mm -hmm. All right, this life is not it. Even to the even to the little things like food, man. All right, <clears throat> even to even to our clothes, man. Our you know mixed fabrics. You know, Lord has it where He made certain fabrics for, for certain reason, man. Our certain certain fabrics hold a good vibration. All right, it, certain fabrics help the body and things that sort. But you know, we in this situ society where they mix the fabrics and you know they don't really work how it's usually supposed to work. You know, I'm just pinpointing little things, but you know, it, it, the little things matter too. Are right, all all the way to the being of us being in captivity. You know, all the way to you know certain things, you know, little things like oh, what we eat or what we wear. Okay, but you got it. Mhm. Mm That's right. Okay, you got things called uh, lab grown meat. Mm -hmm. You know, lab lab grown meat. Okay, lab grown meat. You know what the whatever the fuck Esau did, we don't know what Esau did to the meat. Okay, the meat, the meat, you're not even uh, really providing what was giving what it's supposed to give. Cause Esau messing with it, man. Like like you got seedless grapes. Okay, you get down. I'm gonna get down to Genesis. Mm -hmm. Which the Lord made, you know, things after His own kind. All right, even to the foods, man. All right, this this the Lord's had a had a, a grapes, a grape seed making grapes, apples making apples, oranges making oranges, off of where from coming all the way from the, from that seed. Mm -hmm. All right, now Esau has it where he he's making things. You know, and then producing, and then coming out with no seeds. Like that's confusion, man. Mm -hmm. Are right, you got it? It's Genesis one and eleven. Start at eleven. It says, "And the powers said, let the, the, the powers said, let the earth bring forth grass, and hurt and let the let the earth bring forth grass. The herb yielding seed, and the fruit tree yielding fruit after its kind, whose seed is in its in itself upon the earth, and it was so. Mm -hmm. And the earth. And this, this is it. Oh, you just want to get one. Yeah, and the earth brought forth grass and herb yielding seed after his kind, and the tree yielding fruit, whose seed was in itself after his kind, and the most I saw that it was good. All right, even to the little things, like even to the food, seeds, man. All right, you know, Lord made it since that, since their, since the beginning. We have, we have it now where Esau and his little scientists tapping in to into the food, and where that they're, they're, they're making these foods, but when it comes out, they don't have no seeds, man. Mm -hmm. All right, that's not how the Lord originally made it, man. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. Cause that was in the Esau trying to, trying to, trying to, you know, make himself look like as a god. Like I could do this. I could do this. Uh, I could create fruit. I could do these different things, man. It's ripping off what the Lord did. Okay, yeah. he's so wicked. Okay, he has to mess with the with the creation, the creation of the Lord. Mm -hmm. Okay, why we can't live like this, man. Okay, the reason we, 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 we the reason we really surviving is ultimately through the through the through the Lord uh, being with us, man. Mm -hmm. Okay, cause we got, you know, you got chemicals in the air, water got plastics in it. Okay, the, the foot, the wall, the uh, when we walk on the, uh, the ground that we walk in is straight concrete, it's pork in the, in the in the street, in the concrete. Okay, and the food Esau got pork in it, but Jake don't know what them, what them big ass words mean, and Jake not gonna search it up, so it's really pork in it. Okay, you got pork and juice. Okay, these different things, man. Okay, down to the food in the air, and, okay, that we eat is it, it, polluted. Okay, and that's also because Esau's in power. Okay, <clears throat> that's another reason why this life ain't it because you got a wicked ruling. All right, the life is our life is we ultimately gonna be, it's gonna be a good stance when your house side is ruling, right? All right, because right now who's ruling the so called white man, which is the you know, wicked man. All right, the Lord says in Job 9 24, the earth was given to the hand of the wicked. All right, that's the, talking about a so-called white man. Why and how do we know that? Because he's able to do these certain things. He's able to, you know, put in these certain foods in these places. Ultimately, control the whole world. All right, but you know we're pinpointing certain points, but it all leads to who's ruling, man. All right, so like where right, everybody said, the water we drink, the um, the air we breathe. All right, the things we walk on, the clothes we wear. All right, the way ultimately how the society works. You know that that we are evolving. You know, it's ultimately backed up by who created it, man. Mm -hmm. All right, the so-called white man. So right. in due time, 
you know, the lawyer, once again, he's going he gonna to settle that one that is profitable, the outside. That's true. You know, and that's when everything going to be in order, man. That's, that's true. Yeah. Hmm? You got to know I said it's true because I'll go get Ciroc 10. I was going to get, I'm going to start at one because I was going to read that anyway. This is a wise judge will instruct his people and the government and the government of a prudent man is well ordered. All right. And who got ultimately, who's ultimately that wise judge, man? All right, well, yeah, how was I, man? Well, yeah, how would by Simi I was Okay, he says, and as the judge of the people is, is himself, so as his officer, and what manner of man the ruler of the city is, such as all that door they're in. Right, using it, for example, with Esau. Esau being wicked. Okay, it's like it's like Esau being wicked, the, uh, those under him being wicked, you know, and them them under them being wicked. So everybody's just, it's just wicked, man. Okay, it says, and unwise king destroy his people, but the, through their prudence of them which are in authority, the city shall be inhabited. Right, and look how and look how Esau rules the society, man. Okay, the people are people look the, the people are destroyed, okay, mentally and spiritually. Okay, there's there there isn't no don't they're not they're not they don't look like uh I'm gonna say they don't look live lively. Like they're actually living. Everybody everybody look dead. Okay, because those are the food that they eat it, man, and, and and the people in power. Okay, it says the power of the earth is in the hand of the Lord, and in due time he will set over it that that he will say ever it one that is profitable. And, that, and that's also me talking about Yahweh Shai, man. Okay, in the kingdom, man. It could be Yahweh Shai, okay. Be Yahweh Shai, the, the 12, and then the, the elect being the, the government body. And and, and and through them, okay, the, the, it's going to be righteousness be, uh, brought forth in the earth. Okay. Yeah. Right. <clears throat> <clears throat> this is Haggai 1 and 6. You have so much and bring little. You eat, but you have not enough. You drink, but you are not filled with drink. You clothe you, but you, but there is no warm. And he that in wages put it, put into a bag with holes. Right, man. You know, hey, 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 you work, but you, but you don't really get 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 much from what you're working for, man. You know, you know, Jacob work all these long hours. You know, working, making all that money, but guess what? You, you gotta pay bills, man. You know, mm -hmm. you <laughs> you drink water, and you not, and your thirst is not quenched, man. You drink water, and then you know, ten minutes later, you thirsty again, man. You, 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 you eat an hour ago, you know, instead of you being full, nah, you gotta eat something else, man. Cause, cause you know that Esau fucked with the food, man. You know, this is the, this is not the place that that Lord has. That destined for us to live, man. You know, the food. We, we we keep going back to food because the food ultimately is a major thing. It would, it's ultimately it's gonna give you energy. All right, but the food that we eat right now, it's not really you know, doing anything. All right, all right. For example, orange or apple. You know, one orange or apple sort of give you a certain amount of energy. But nowadays, you gotta eat uh, multiple amounts of apple just to get the feeling of that one apple how it used to be back then. Mm -hmm. All right, so you showing you you know how times you know. Are getting worse, showing you how defiled the, the food is. Okay, mm -hmm. you know, but uh, you know that's that's what we living in. Cause it gets worse and worse on time. Mm -hmm. It get worse and worse as time comes. It just get worse and worse. Everything things get. Uh, they get lessened or they get or they get they get weaker. Okay, they get weaker. You know, look at us. Okay, men back then used to live, hundreds of years, man. Okay, hundreds of years. The food was the food was at its at its peak back then. Okay, the people. Okay, they they were bigger, stronger, smarter. Okay, you look at the people now. Okay, you read the scriptures. You read how long these, these certain men lived. Okay, you look at it now, like damn. Okay, you know, like you know, this things got you know lessened. Okay. Mm -hmm. You just say that too. You know, back then, you know, the earth was in its fullest form, man. You know, bringing bringing forth the best fruits, the best vegetables. You know, and, and, you know now you saw. You know, the, the earth is like in its weakest form, man. You know, it's not bringing forth the best fruit. You know, and and, and if it is, you know, a Esau comes and fucks with it, you know, put pesticides and everything on top of food, you know. So you're not eating the, the nutrients that you're supposed to get from that one fruit or vegetable. You're not getting it from, man. You would have to eat multiple quantities of that fruit to get just that nutrients that you're supposed to get, man. Mm -hmm. You know? But hey, we also know that hey, in the kingdom, hey, everything gonna re restore back to normal, man. You know, everything gonna be, you know, in its full form again. You know, bringing forth plenty of fruit and vegetables, man. Mm -hmm. To the point in the beginning of the world, 
when the Lord made the world, it didn't rain. The, the soil was so, it, it had dew. And that was dew. It, it, was, it was mainly dew because to the point where the soil was very rich. All right, the soil was very rich, so it didn't really have to rain. But now, you pick, you, you pick it up, uh, the soil right now ain't, ain't really that good, man. Mm-hmm. Alright, that's why you gotta add all these little things to it to you know, wrench it in. But ultimately, the, the soil, the, you know, dirt we have right now is not that good. Mm-hmm. Okay, it's 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 you know it crumb it's, it crumb it look like like cement or something. Like that's how bad the soil is as of right now. You can't forget you can't forget that too. Hey, the, hey, the dirt we got now, done 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 freaking absorb so much blood, you know. You know, from from killings and slavery and all that stuff in the earth has sucked sucked so much up. So you know that really deteriorates the earth from bringing forth its full fruit, man. Mm-hmm. You know, and I, and I think it's good to speak about that too. What that war to him that bleeds in the city on blood? What are you talking about? Well, war that too. That's talking about Easter, but it's, a, it's another priest that speaks about that. You know, God, God. I think the earth mourning. That's, that's, that's what you got. You talking about the Christian grain within itself? Yeah. I don't got that. I got something else. It's numbers thirty five and thirty three. Okay. It says, so you shall not. Yeah. It's in Corinthians. It's uh, Numbers 35 and 33. It says, so you shall not pollute the land where you are. For the blood it, for the blood it defileth the land. And land cannot be cleansed of the blood that is shed therein, but by the blood of him that cleanses it. Right? So, through all the Esau's bloodshed, basically defiled the land, man. Okay? Because all Esau did was kill, 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 kill. He still cut it down. Mm-hmm. Okay? And the blood defiled the whole land, man. The, the land has been built off of blood. Okay, the land has been built off straight blood. Okay, and that's not the only reason, too, because that's straight y'all talking about. So I was thinking about it, too. You know, Esau don't respect the land, Sabbath. You know, he's supposed to leave the land alone for a certain amount of time. Exactly. Okay, Esau don't do it. He just plant, rip out, rip out, rip out, rip out, not giving it time to rest. Okay, showing that, again, he's not supposed to be in power. Mm-hmm. Okay, the ship's talking about, you know, putting the Lord put the basis of men, okay, in power, man. But, okay. And we and we see and we see that when he's in power, we see how the the the, the way the earth is being ruled. Okay, and we see that it's not the right the right way. Okay, but in the kingdom we're gonna know. Okay, you, know you got it. You know Esau doesn't respect the land side, but you write on that too. And also it's like Esau used these these pesticides to uh, speed up, you know, the the ripeness of you know fruits and vegetables, and he had steroids to 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 to, to the animal, you know, so they could, so they could appear more you know bigger. You know, fatter, so he can sell them. You know, mm-hmm. so it, you know, we man the devil, man. So uh, every everything that's supposed to be natural ain't natural. You know, you could you could you could, you could get the naturalist thing ever, but you saw already done fucked with it. All you right. know, I forgot the thing you said in first grade. Yeah. First grade is the second chapter, the first chapter. That's it. That's it. it, it it's towards the end. One. That's how you know this place is fucked up. You know, I remember. Um, I believe it was a brother. I think it was Camp that was speaking on this lawyer. You know saying it shouldn't be, it shouldn't be a, a, a um, or organic side and a, a non-organic side. Mm-hmm. Everything should be already organic. Why is there, you know, you have to make it organic? I right, show you how fucked up this place is, and that's that's a that's a normal thing nowadays. Mm-hmm. You know, nobody nobody really questions that. They'll say, all right, let me go, let me go, go to the grocery store. So, all right, let me go buy from the organic side. Why is not to the point all foods are organic? All right, the Lord made all these foods organic. Why the fuck in, in, in the world is that you have to? Is it two different? So, uh, two different when it comes to food. Right? Mm-hmm. That, that's a that's a point. That should really put a light bulb over your head. Like what the fuck? Like that that doesn't make no sense. All right, shouldn't all food that come from the earth be natural and organic? Okay, mm-hmm. it shouldn't have to be tapered in where you have a section in the store organic foods and a section that just regular food. <laughs> so you have fucked up the spaces, man. And then. And, and, and the majority of the time, he saw how the devil is. The fucked up food will cost way cheaper than the organic food. Mm-hmm. You know, the, the, the organic food will be way more expensive. You know, because guess what? You, you may be getting some of that nutrient that you're supposed to get, man. You know? But he he prices the the the, uh, the fucked up food. And when the, food, the food is not good for you, you know, at, at a lower price so that you can keep buying it, keep getting sick. You know, keep and keep running back to him, man. It's like it's like a, it's, a, it's like a hamster in a freaking wheel of shit that spins, man. You yeah. know, those rolls from it. I, I got it. Yeah. Romans eight and start at twenty one. Start at twenty says, for the creature was made subject to vanity, 
not willingly, but by reason of him who had subjected the same in hope. Because the creature itself also shall be delivered from the bondage of corruption into the glorious liberty of the children of the Most High. For we know that the whole creature groaning and travailing in pain together until now. But you got it. All right, man. And, 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 and we also know that, guess what? It, 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 trees, you know, the animals mourn, you know, and it, it also the earth, man, you know? Because guess what? Esau's in rulership, man. And he's fucking up the earth, man. Chem shows in the air, fucking up the water, you know? He, he's not listening to the land seven. He's, he's putting pesticides in the ground, you know? He even he caused so much bloodshed in the earth to where, to where the earth mourns, man, you know? So, his man the devil, man. Uh, uh, that's why the place that we in now, you know, this is not the place that the Lord has destined for us, man. You know, Lord, when we endure, he, 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 the Lord got the kingdom for us, man. And then in, in due time, the earth is going to be yielding for hey, the best fruit, man. You know, the hundred, the, you going you, you, you know, when you part of luck, you know, you're going to be eating, you know, a real chicken. You know, you're going to be eating, eating a real apple or fruit you never ate before, man. You know? Uh, but. That's great, you know. We just pinpoint, you know, we the spirit has a word, you know, we speak on this, but we just pinpoint why this life ain't it. Also, you know, you speak about the captivity, you know, because we, we understand we in captivity. That's another reason why. Also, understand that we, 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 work, we work our ass off, all right, you know. Which I got right here is Genesis chapter 3, verse 19. It says, In the sweat of thy face shall thy eat bread to thy return unto the ground. Mm -hmm. For out of it had, for out of it was thou taken, for thus thou art. And and unto dust thou shalt return. Mm -hmm. All right, so we we we. This is all the way from the beginning of Genesis, man. All right, way before you know the curses. All right, so this mm -hmm. this has been told unto that we are gonna have to work for you know work for you know what we need, man. You don't you don't work, you don't eat. Yeah, you, don't you, don't, you, don't, you don't work till you die. <laughs> all right, that was way since you know the beginning, man. Mm -hmm. Showing you that that this not it, man. You know you get tired of working, man. You get tired of waking up early in the morning. All right, just to you know, go to the little, you know, crumping job. All right, <laughs> come back tired, even up to body infirmities. You know, this ain't it, man. All right, this 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 is not a life that you know you want to live, man. Yeah, right. This uh, is. Uh, I was gonna say so. Uh, even like, it was a clip with a little baby. He said the same shit. He was like, he said, I already know I'm gonna work till I die. <laughs> you know what I mean, he got millions. He got millions. He got millions, man. Yeah, okay, just, he, and he's saying that it's showing you that it's it's already it, you know you just work till you die. The Lord already been that was already been set in place, man. Because how how can this be life if you working until you die, man? People come out of retirement, come back to working. Okay, if you're retired, come out of retirement, it's the working, man. Mm -hmm. Okay, this can't this can't be how you know that's that's not how the Lord originally planned it to be. Mm -hmm. Okay. Showing the too him showing you that man plus little baby's not a regular person, man. It's something we're talking about a millionaire. So somebody that has the riches, you know. Some somebody that can afford, you know, the the high quality shit. He's saying that he already know that he gonna be working till he died, man. Right, he said he said also he says he told he had asked uh uh the female that was interviewing him, he said, Who do you know who who do you know that 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 that, that don't work? He said everybody work. I mean, that's true, man. Okay, especially Jake working every day, working six, seven days a week. Mm -hmm. Okay, he's always going, always doing something, man, working. Okay, and you you supposed, you supposed to come to a certain age, your body don't even, your body don't work as it used to, so you can't really work for it. You supposed to, you know, just relax, man. Mm -hmm. Okay, and just wait till you just pass. Man, even if you, even if you got, you know, even if you think that you're a, a multi-millionaire, you're a billionaire, you 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 still gotta acquire. You still have to work, man. You know, these hey, these billionaires, Jeff Bezos and all these billionaires, they, they still got to work, man. You know, they got to keep their business going, man. You know? Mm -hmm. You still got... So I guess why I should say you subject... The scriptures talk about Jake being subject to payments. Jake always got to work because he's subject to payments. I mean, got bills got to get paid. Okay? He got a house... house. Jake bought a house, but the house still, you still got to pay off that house. You bought a car, you still got to pay off the car. Mm -hmm. All right, you should. Even to your little, little cellular device, you got, you got to pay that off, man. It don't matter. You know, one of the curses, you know. So, either way, you know, we, we this life ain't it, man. All right, you might have a little son, something now and then, but at the end of the day, shit, 
you know, you, we still under this curses, man. Right, right. All right, you know, now you, you go to you go through all the lists, you know, the list, it gives you a, every reason why this place is not it. Okay. You know, you're, you're not, one, one I like to bring an example is, you know, you're not even assured of your life, man. Uh, you know, that's part of the curses, you know. You know, all constantly being on, constantly be on the lookout. You get it. Constantly being, constantly being on, on the lookout. Hold on. Constantly being on the lookout of your life, man. That's 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 that gives you a reason why this place not in. But in the kingdom, you're not gonna have to worry about that. It says, um, Deuteronomy chapter twenty eight verse sixty six. It says, "And thy life shall hang in doubt before thee, and thou shalt fear day and night, and shalt not have no assurance of thy life." All right, that's ultimately because you understand the curse is ultimately for the Negro, so called Negro, Latino, Native Americans, which is this truth is only for the Negro, Latino, Native Americans, ultimately. Like, but, um, it's just true, man. You know, we're not, we're not sure of our life. That's why Jake, you know, Jake, even uh, to us, you know, we understand we have Yahweh Shema Shai on our side, but, you know, you know, we live in, you know, we live in fear of our life sometimes. Okay. You know, to the point where, you know, we constantly pay attention to our surroundings. Or there's certain things that we wouldn't do just to protect ourselves. You know, you know we're not going to walk at nighttime like Esau, you know, for no no fucking reason, you know. Mm-hmm. Jake, you know, Jake, you know, will move a certain way. All right, he's not walking in the middle of an alley by himself or things of that sort, man. Right? Mm-hmm. All right, that's, that's living the fear of our life, man. But showing you that this life, isn't it? I'll just bring out that example real quick. All right, and uh, you know, in the kingdom, hey, you gotta laugh at this, man. Mm-hmm. Like, hey, imagine you gonna be in the king because we ain't gonna be under curses no more. You, gonna, you know, it's gonna be blessings after blessings. Okay, and it's gonna be peace. So we gonna be thinking like, damn, you remember when you know used to be back there? We all used to, you know, a fucking car would come by. We just look at this. You start, we gonna start laughing, man. Mm-hmm. Okay, how we used to be, and, and, and to actually take into account how we, how we are, how we are gonna be. Okay. Listen. Come with that love willing. You know this lesson was edifying. I'm gonna give all praises to Yahweh by Hashem, Yahweh Shai by Hashem, Kapadash. The bondage to the apostles and elders gave millstone and shalom to the Akim, teaching his word